Hey there everyone, this is Harrison from Pinnacle West and today we have an unboxing of the Fusion FX. This is the result of many years of work and improvement from Graco to create the smallest, lightest and best balanced gun ever built. Today we're gonna unbox, let's move this over, FX9001, which is just one of the configurations of the FX you can get. Configured as a clear shot gun, but also comes with the air purge piston. Without any further ado, let's tear into this thing. Open up the top of the box here. First off, we see a manual. Really handy to attach into your rig. Just have a nice little quick start guide to look through for the FX. Certainly gonna be a lot easier to use than the AP and PC were. Like I said, this is a culmination of many years of work to improve spray foam and polyurea gun technology. Now, as we move into here, there's our gun. Don't look at that yet, because here we have a box of parts and goodies. This is a blind walkthrough, so I'm learning, looking at it as we go through here. So first off, we have a bag. These are the seals for the back of the mixing chamber, and you're going to be really excited when we see the mixing chamber, but this allows you to just get a little bit more life out of your mixing chambers. Fantastic. Moving on. Let's go in here. This here show you the box there. This is the FX cartridge. So like I said, culmination of many years of work in this gun. And the difference, this one is that it takes the entire fluid head, fluid portion of the gun and puts it into this one handy cartridge. Now difference from the PC cartridge, of course, this is everything inside of here. And this can be serviced. And we're going to see some of those tools as we go through but there is our FX cartridge. And of course the other one comes in the gun, but you're not supposed to be looking at that yet. Just kidding. And then let's keep tearing into this box. Here we have our mixing chamber. So we can see those mixing chambers. These are absolutely tiny. I'll open one of these up here in a minute, but we're just gonna push this to the side. This kit comes with a 37, a 42, and a 47. Now the key thing to note with the FX is that there's less pressure drop throughout this gun. So the output is going to be greater compared to if you had an AP or a PC. So um, in this gun, you have a 37, 42 and 47, but really those are going to behave like the next chamber up from what you're used to. So 37, 42 and 47 are going to act more like there's a little bit of difference, but more like a 42, a 47 and a 52, which of course, are the most popular chambers that people will have. Turning through here, there's our 37 chamber. So we've got a 47 over here. We've got a 37 right there. And then leave it. There's our 42. Inside the mixing chamber bags, you will have included one mixing chamber and two drill bits, one for the main chamber itself and one for the impingement ports. And then next we have a kit plug tube for the CS, kit plug for the CS. Okay, so this goes into the bottom of the gun. Um, and like I mentioned earlier, this gun can be configured in CS or AP. And you make a few differences or a few additions to the handle to run in either one, in addition to the air piston uh, in the air portion of the gun. So that's what this is here. So this is a plug for the bottom of the gun to help seal in those CS cartridges. Some clarification here on the purpose of this plug. It's actually used to plug up the handle when the gun is in AP mode. When you have the gun in CS mode, your CS cartridge will go in to the handle just like so. I mentioned earlier that the, uh, the gun itself or the cartridge that we looked at earlier in this box right here is serviceable. And they have this tool right here, which helps you to service that chamber inside the gun and really get the most life that you can out of that cartridge. We're gonna have more videos showing you how to use this and more details on the FX. This is just a high level overview of what you get in FX 9001. And here we have, I'll pop up what that is on the screen here, but there is that one there. And we're almost through. They include a lot of goodies. 
inside here. This is a part for our manifold. So this is going to go on to the bottom of the gun, right where the manifold hooks in. And so that's this bit right here. And this bag is just never ending. There's your air cap. It's kind of hard to see. They again, a difference with the uh, FX as compared to the previous guns that you have to have this air cap on pretty tight. And that's because, you know, when we'll look at future videos, the mix chamber is attached directly to this air cap. Um, let's see if I can move this over and show you. Although well, they put it on a different side, but you can see that the mixing chamber is actually going to attach right in back here. And that's why they want you to seat it in really tight so you get that good seal and you don't get any leakage and you avoid any crossover. We definitely don't want that. Final thing in our magic bag of holding here is... Again, I don't know exactly what this part is, but I'll pop it up on the screen. And there that is for you. Perfect. Now, star of the show is the Fusion FX spray foam gun. Like I said, the culmination of many years of work from Graco in this one. So let's just, right underneath it, there's another little manual here for you. This one principally talking about that cartridge that we looked at before. And this just kind of shows you what you need to do. If you notice any leakage, if these things are happening, it's gone bad, you need to bin it. If these things are happening, it's salvageable. And you might just need to do a little bit of work on it. If you speak Spanish, there it is. Perfect. Let's run back to the gun because that's really what you're all here for. I think I made you all wait long enough. Here is the Fusion FX spray foam gun. This thing, you really doesn't look it. And it may not sound like a lot, but this is a pound lighter than the PC. And they say it's nine times better balanced. And here is the FX. Looks very different as compared to the PC and AP. And it really is the next step in fusion guns. So like I said, it's a pound over a pound lighter. I think it's like 0.54 kilograms lighter, which makes a huge difference. And the biggest difference is in the weight up here. Of course, when you're spraying with a PC, you kind of notice it starts to pull forward a little bit just because that weight at the front. This is much more balanced as compared. It also has a 30% shorter trigger pull. So that results in less wear when you're pulling and also quicker responsiveness when you're doing the little quick touch-ups. When we look on here, we have our manifold comes installed. And we have these wing nuts here, which make it easy for you to turn on and off the flow of chemical just by hand. You don't need to use your 5 16th driver to do that. So there is our FX, also comes with this handle. Just a fantastic gun. We're going to have more videos on this, including a breakdown. And it's going to be a short one because this can be serviced incredibly quickly. So there is our Fusion FX spray foam gun. Some more manuals, information on the FX, not really important for this video. And then we have a whole ton of accessories. So let me just open this one up here. Here's this box here. Oh, there we go. Comes out like this. Well, would you believe there are more goodies and bits inside here? So let's start tearing into these. Like I said, this is a blind look through. Okay. So here we go. So you've seen this before. This is a quick shot, quick shot cartridge and the gun. So it still uses this. It's all compatible with the uh, quick shot grease that you already have for your Fusion AP or PC. Um, they just give you another one if you don't already have it. Um, now, one quick segue here. Um, we had our mixing chambers. And you'll notice in here, might not come out on the camera, but you can see that those drill bits are blue. And that's because this mixing chamber, albeit being a 37, the inside diameter is slightly different as compared to what you'd have on, let's say, a PC 32RD or a AP 3737. So they've colored them blue just to make it easier, especially if you're running, you know, more than one gun at one time. They have this 
Um, they have these drill bits painted blue so that you don't mix them up. And it's very important that you use the matching drill bits, or yeah, the matching drill bits for the FX. Just a little note there. Also comes with, we were talking about grease there earlier. Don't use this for your teeth, but we have tube of fusion lithium grease. No moisture in these, which is really important because as we all know, isocyanate does not like moisture. Let's keep going into here. Just your typical air hose in this one. And let's see what we have in this box. This is part number 256384. Let's open this up. See what we have inside here. I actually don't know what this one is. Ah, there we go. Comes with six of the clear shot cartridges. So like I mentioned, this can be configured as CS, which is clear shot or AP, which is air purge. Um, and essentially this goes into these cartridges, go into the handle of the gun. And when you let off the trigger, it's going to shoot that, that this material, this chemical through, and it's going to help keep that chamber clear. So really handy for people, especially if you're doing big open spaces, you're not letting off the trigger that much. You can use this and it keeps your chamber much cleaner and you have to drill it out less. And so there is that one. We'll just put this to the side for now. And as we're going through here, kind of what I know what this one is already. This is the AP air piston. So as I mentioned a few times now, this comes as CS or AP, comes configured as CS. But if you want to switch it over to AP, this would be your air piston. We're going to show you how to do that in another video. But this is the AP air purge. That's kind of the same thing. Air purge piston, which you can put into the gun and you can switch this over in no time. So there is your air purge piston. Comes a nice little tube for storage. And then, wow, we're towards the end here. But we're, but we're really not because more items inside here. I'm not going to go over all these. They're really just kind of small little goodies and stuff. Extra, you know, ball valves right there inside air fittings. 5 16th ball driver. We used a lot in this gun when you're servicing it and taking it apart. Comes with a pin vise. You can use the same pin vise as you already have for those new drill bits. And then we have a little screwdriver. Fantastic, everyone. Well, hey, this has been an unboxing of FX9001, which is the currently available configuration of the Fusion FX. This is really exciting. If you could feel this in your hand, it's almost like holding air. It's amazing how light this thing is. A fantastic new gun. We're going to have a lot more content on this. Thanks for watching. It's Harrison from Pinnacle West, your one-stop shop for all things foam and coatings. Have a great day.